During a time of downturn and during a time of COVID, we are at great risk to be taken advantage of. There are sometimes business people that have no scruples and they have no morals and no ethics. During a time of downturn in the economy, you can have an employee or an employee troop show up at your business or up at your property and show up at your building and start to do things. And then once the building is completed in terms of the work order they've chosen to create for their company, they then bill your company and say, well, we did this. So-and-so assigned this. And what they do is they steal a name of an executive or borrow one off a manager's card and then you're left with this immoral act of owing a corporation or a small company that is in need of business thousands to millions of dollars. At the present moment, I'm in the process of hearing major noise ordinances violated with a group and troop of Hispanic workers that are apparently doing a new roof. I'm not sure why they need to do so. I don't know that there's any leaks going on, but again, I'm not a part of property management. But I suppose this would be the only time that an employee might as a manager of a company, step outside their proper job to simply reach out to whoever the liaison is at their corporation to say, hey, just was curious, are we expecting a new roof right now? Because all this stuff on the sidewalk is sort of impeding the traffic coming into our business. I just want to check. I don't want to cause any trouble. I just want to make sure we're not going to be taken advantage of in terms of what our company and at this property will be charged for. Because obviously what they do as a property management company is they amortize the cost of changes across every business. So in a way, people can get a double whammy. And the double whammy is that the property management company can get saddled with an immoral and illegal bill. But then the um, renters can also get then saddled with an increase in their rentage or an extra bill for their property management company.